Welcome once again, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, to Cosmic Theater. I'm your host, Dr. Franklin Rule. Today we pay special homage to the late actress Linda Christian, who just died at age 87. Linda, perhaps best known for being the wife of actor Tyrone Power. This movie from 1962 is The Devil's Hand, in which she plays a she-devil, Bianca Milan. The co-star, Robert Alda, is a man who joins the satanic cult. Now, roll tape. There she is dancing in all her glory. How could I explain when I myself couldn't understand? To dream about a woman night after night, a woman I'd never met, never seen before. And with each dream, she became more real, more alive, until it seemed that if my hand reached out, I could have touched her. Some will stronger than my own brought me here. Nothing was familiar to me. I'd never been here before, and yet I wasn't lost. That's Coronado Street in Los Angeles. I was guiding my steps, leading me to this courtyard. There was something here that was drawing me close, like a magnet. I could feel it pulling me closer, closer. And then, I saw it. I can bridge any distance between us. No matter how great or how small. Concentration is essential. Tell when I've made contact with you. When my thoughts and my image have reached you. Just relax and close your eyes. While I come to pray. Oh, great darling. Open your eyes. That's Neil Hamilton as the High Executioner. Oh, great Gamba, we offer a new subject who has come to join us. During his trial period, watch him, study him, and then test him, oh, great devil god. Will you swear absolute allegiance to the great devil god, Gamba? I will. Will you follow his commands without question? Though it means someone's destruction, even your own, I will. You will, above all else, seal your lips and swear yourself to secrecy. I will. 
You, his sponsor, will be held accountable. You accept this responsibility? I do. It is done. From this moment on, there is no turning back. You are one of us now. A member of the cult of the great devil god, Gamba. Guard this privilege well. To be the sacrifice. You stare at her without recognition. But there is one here who knows her. She was a part of his past. A past he should have deserted when he declared himself to Gamba. I did, I swear it. Why then did you enter these premises one night under the veil of darkness? Why then did you remove the pin from the doll there by administering a cure? I have not been disloyal. Bianca, tell him. You've got to believe me. Oh, great Gamba, he asks for your trust. This unworthy servant begs to be believed. It is for you to say. Step forward. Prove yourself. It shall be your hand that turns the wheel. My hand? Yes, your hand. Then I am to blame the sword. Blame? This is not a question of blame. This is a question of loyalty. Spin the wheel. Spin it! Now, I submit to you that this was Linda Christian's finest performance on the silver screen. I should point out that there were some slow moments in this, but was an interesting paranormal film. So in the rule scale, were first magnitude's best, tenth magnitude worst, The Devil's Hand from 1962 garners a 3.75 rating. I should point out that her actual given name was Blanca Rosa Welter, and Robert Alda's original name was Alfonso Abruzzo. He was the father of the actor Alan Alda. Now, until next time, may the power of the cosmos be with you. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs>